Hey guys, what's up? I am back with a brand new video and it's time to do a speed test comparison between the Xiaomi 11T versus the Vivo X60 Pro and the Vivo X60 Pro is powered by a Qualcomm Snapdragon 870 processor with a 12 GP of RAM while on the Xiaomi 11T we have a MediaTek Tamacity 1200 Ultra processor with 8 GP of RAM on the back we have triple cameras on both phones we have a 48 megapixel main camera f1.8 aperture which also has a gimbal optical image separation on the vivo x60 pro also we have a 13 megapixel ultra wide we also have a 13 megapixel telephoto lens which give you a 2x optical zoom while on the xiaomi 11t we have a 108 megapixel main camera f1.8 aperture also we have 8 megapixel ultra wide we also have a 5 megapixel telephoto lens which is a macro shorts although the back it is made up of glass on both phones and the frame on both phones is made up of aluminium so that's really good thing on the front we have a coring gorilla glass version 6 on the x60 pro while on the 11t we have a coring gorilla glass victus also on the bottom no headphone jack on both phones we have a single speaker on the vivo x60 pro versus a duo speakers on the xiaomi 11t so in this video i'm going to show you how much a difference between a vivo x60 pro versus the xiaomi 11t now let's quickly boot both of these phones up at the same time here we go and the logo is came up first on the x60 pro as compared to the xiaomi also we have android 11 on both phones we have fun touch os version 11 versus me ui version 12.5 latest software on both phones and the vivo x60 pro more faster when it comes to putting up and you can see by a huge merger and the 11t it is also right behind there about one or two second difference between these two devices now let's talk about the displays between these two devices we have 6.67 inch full hd amoled display which can produce up to 1 billion colors also we have 120 hertz refresh rate on the xiaomi 11t while on the vivo x60 pro we have a 6.5 inch full hd amoled display with 120 hertz refresh rate and both phones also has a punch hole on the center which looks very similar on both phones and the one thing it is also really good on the x60 pro is that this phone has curved display which feels which feels more premium as compared to the xiaomi 11t which has a flat display so now let's see apps opening speed everything is closed up in the background also we have same wi-fi network on both phones now let's see phone dialer that is exactly the same on both phones now let's see settings again exactly the same so now let's go to the display and you can see we have 120 hertz refresh rate on both phones that's really good thing we have auto refresh now let's check out some more application like amazon shopping now let's see that which one is going to be the fastest one launching at the same time snapdragon 870 versus a domacity 1200 a little bit more faster on the 11t let's see the scrolling that is very similar on both phones which is obvious 120 hertz refresh rate no difference there now let's see some games application let's see candy crush saga faster on the vivo x60 pro as camera to the xiaomi 11t hit the speakers of the 11t max volume very good speakers here's the speakers of the x60 pro single speaker and you can see no bass anything like that on the x60 pro speakers which is much higher on the 11t speakers instagram faster on the x60 pro let's see pin out a little bit more faster on the x60 pro as compared to the xiaomi 11t let's see snapchat faster on the x60 pro again now let's see spotify and the spotify very similar let's see subway suffer and the x60 pro a little bit more faster this time yes it is more faster this time as compared to the xiaomi 11t now let's open the pubg mobile on both phones and let's see which one faster again the vivo x60 pro faster so which means that and the snapdragon 870 inside the vivo x60 pro is performed more faster x60 pro is done and the 11t it is also done in the pubg mobile game we have smooth graphics with 90 fps while on the x60 pro we have smooth graphics with extreme frame rate and the extreme frame rate also available in the balance hd hdr while on the 11t after the smooth graphics we have ultra frame rate in the balanced hd hdr no extreme frame rate so now let's see tamper and 2 on both phones 
last game application we have in this speed test and this time the 11t pro 11t i mean a little bit more faster there so 11t a little bit more faster there no huge difference you can see and mostly the x60 pro is performed more faster in the game app loading time now let's see twitter and faster on the x60 pro again now let's open the zedge same wi-fi network again faster on the 11t a little bit more faster there now let's see the scrolling very very smooth on both phones 120 hertz refresh rate makes everything more smoother i didn't see any lag on both phones so that's really good thing last time i'm launching the cameras on both phones before camera application let's see who is faster there faster on the x60 pro as compared to the 11t and i already done the camera test of the xiaomi 11t with the samsung galaxy a 32 s 5g on my channel so if you're interested watch that on my youtube channel now let's see internet blown speed i am seeing for google chrome on both phones now let's open the wikipedia very similar let's see the scrolling and very smooth on both phones 120 hertz refresh rate no lag whatsoever on both phones now let's open this ours and again very similar on both phones let's see the scrolling very very smooth 120 hertz same thing with zooming out no lag whatsoever next on the list is the apple.com should be more faster on the 11t looks like yes it is more faster there as compared to the x60 pro now the x60 pro it is also done let's see the scrolling very smooth on both phones 120 hertz refresh rate so guys now let's see ram management on both phones again we have 8 gp of ram on the 11t while on the x60 pro we have a 12 gp of ram now let's see that who is performed good in the ram management now let's start off with the phone dialer that is seems like refresh let's see settings no refresh let's see amazon shopping no refresh let's see candy crush saga refresh on the 11t instagram refresh let's see pin out refresh again let's see snapchat refresh let's see spotify refresh let's see sub suffer and that car refresh on both phones let's see pub mobile refresh on the 11t so that's really bad thing let's see temper and two refresh now let's see now let's see tutor that is seems like refresh zedge last way back to the internet browser where we left and you can see and cast over i have to say regarding the app's opening speed as you can see that and the vivo s60 pro is performed more faster in the game app loading time as compared to the xiaomi 11t i would say that in system based application and both phones is performed very similar in terms of the ram image wise and the vivo s60 pro is performed a little bit more better in the ram image band as compared to the xiaomi 11t also on the vivo x60 pro we have 4200 mAh battery size so that is why this phone feels really light in hand while on the xiaomi 11t we we have 5000 mAh battery size with a 67 watt fast charging as well so yes and this phone feels a little bit more heavier as compared to the x60 pro but not that much and that's about it and thank you so much for watching this speed test comparison between the xiaomi 11t versus the vivo x60 pro let me know your thoughts in the comment section below subscribe to my channel for daily tech videos and follow me on instagram and twitter as well and i will see you in my next video peace out